good morning students let's understand how to attempt the exams in this new software go to lms click on online exams now under objective exam this exam is coming let's start this exam okay so there are there is only one question right now what is the file extension of python program choose the correct option you can save it for uh, review also or if you show if you are very sure that this answer is correct then you can click on save button right and all questions will appear here this is question number one because i right now i have created only one question so only one is coming otherwise one two three four all numbers will appear here you can the even after doing question number one you can directly switch to question number 10 and uh, uh, here it will show it will be shown like this that these are the questions that you have already answered and saved also these questions you have not visited these questions so these tabs will appear in these colors green green means you have already answered red means you have not answered marked for review and not visited so like this is my correct answer then i'll click on save and next okay so now this the color is green in color now because i have already answered this question now click on finish exam if you wanted to end this exam click on finish exam please verify all answers before submitting the exam you wanted to verify you can click on this you wanted to submit you can click on this exam complete done now let's understand how to attempt subjective exam click on subjective exam these are the three exams coming let's say i wanted to appear for this exam click on view question paper now first you have to open the question paper and read all the questions you can uh, start writing all the answers in your notebook right so you can write all the answers in your notebook now go back now click on upload answer sheet now here you have to after because you have already written all the answers in your answer uh, in your notebook click the pictures from your mobile phone and uh, you can upload as a uh, maximum tw 20 pictures here 20 images are allowed to upload but file size of each image should be less than 10 mb each image right upload the files one by one if it is an image then upload it one by one if it is a pdf then you can upload it in one go let's say i'm showing you one pdf let's say this pdf i wanted to upload open click on upload this file is already uploaded here file name is coming and you can delete it before submitting the exam if you don't want to next is I am uploading a picture now so I cannot select all the pictures in one go one by one I need to select open upload choose the next image because you have already attempted the whole paper so you can upload maximum 10 images if you know that the images are more than 10 you can convert it into a pdf and then you can upload it right so like this all your files will appear at the end of your exam you can just review whatever you have uploaded like this And if you are okay with all the files which you have uploaded, you can click on submit button. Exam submitted successfully. Okay. Right. This is how you have to attempt objective as well as subjective exam. Where we got these options of objective and some summative exams. You can go to LMS, which will appear on the left hand side of your dashboard. Here it is. Then go to online exams and start doing your exam. You can click on result and check your result also. So mark secured 100%. Submitted exam. 
because this is a supplementary exam so the teacher will check first and then only you will get an option to check your marks right so i hope it is clear to everyone 